so I am only 10 minutes late so far. I gotta wait another five and then I will hit my CP time mark. Dude, I'm so excited about this album. I am so excited. If you don't like the band, you're an idiot. <laughs> Just to let you know. I hope I clarify things for you. Um. <laughs> but I can seriously fix this entire world because I have the intuition to do that. But it's not my job to fix the world. It's not my job to implement these things. It's just my job to tell you these things. The best way that I can tell you is to show you how much better my way of life is than yours. Because I have fought this culture tooth and nail since my entry into this shit world. And you know, I was told by a black man, former prison inmate, I met him at Goodwill, he had tattoos all over his face. He was the one that called me 20, because I asked 20 questions. Like I've said before, black people always have better nicknames. Oh, you because know, they're, they're, they, they're from the street, you know? They got street names. You need a street name. I, I do. I really do. If the Vortex would like to help me out with that, that would be cool. You know, uh, Jesus Christ, uh, the street name that I've given him is JC Dollar. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh, my street name for God is Motherfucker. Only an actual Christian would understand that because, like, some fake Christian would get offended by that shit. But, um... Yeah, so, uh, this dude, JT, who called me 20, he said, you know, you can't get mad when you go against the grain and people don't understand, you know? It's just the way it is. You have to, you have to take that shit. He said that to me a long time ago. I believe I was 22 years old, 23 maybe. 22. That's some of the best advice I've ever gotten. So I have this whole thing of jokes that I gotta go through tonight. Let's finish this. over there you guys I just wanted to show you I get really sad when I see things like that and I can't do anything about it can you imagine how I feel about the foster care system <laughs> 